Hi, this is Cody from the C4L Lounge, and today I'm going to show you how to use the Twitter mobile app. So you can see here I have my iPad and I have my Twitter app here. Okay, if I open it up, and I'm working off the assumption you've already downloaded, so if you haven't downloaded the app, you can download it from the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store and just search Twitter. And then once you are have it downloaded, you just sign in with your uh, Twitter credentials that you created. Okay, so the basic layout here is in the top left corner, you have the option here to add new contacts, okay, and find people. This is kind of like the search feature, but it's letting, based off uh, people that you follow and um, your contacts, it's letting you know people that you might want to follow back, okay. Over in the top right corner, you have the search icon. So you can search either a hashtag, such as EdTech, and find tweets that are related to that hashtag. You can also search people by using the at symbol. And find a person you're looking for, like myself, for example. Okay. You can also, from this top section, let me get back, you can post a new tweet by clicking the tweet icon in the top right corner. And so from here you can type in your 140 character tweet, you can add a recent picture or take a new picture, you can create a poll, uh, and then when you're done you just hit the tweet button. Across the, and then in the main part of the page, you have your feed. This is all the tweets coming in in chronological order. Okay, so if you see something you like, you want to go in more detail, you can click on it. And then across the bottom of the page, you have um, the, uh, the buttons to navigate through the different portions of it. So you have the home button to get you back to your feed. You have notifications. Okay, that you know, if someone tweets or retweets or favorites something yours, uh, direct message you, you can get your notifications there. You can see your messages, your DMs here. Uh, then you can see your account information here. Uh, there's also on the, uh, on the iPhone and Android uh, phone app, there's also a fifth button called Moments. And what Moments gives you is actually up-to-date current news based off what's trending. So there you have it. This is just a basic walkthrough of the uh, Twitter app for mobile devices. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to check us out on uh, blog.rcisd.org forward slash C4L or come see us in the C4L lounge.